So now let's talk about how to install TensorFlow on Windows for Python programming language. So the first step is you should go to tensorflow.org slash install. And here you can see that by the time of recording, it says that it supports Python 3.7 all the way up to Python 3.10. So now in order to install the Python itself, you should go to python.org, which is the official website of Python. And you should click on downloads. And here you should scroll down and we can see different versions of Python. As you can see now, by the time of recording, the latest version is Python 3.11. But as you have seen in this web page, it says that it supports Python 3.7 all the way up to 3.10. So we should install Python 3.10. So you can see this is Python 3.10.8. So I click on it. And here in this page, you should just scroll down. And because I'm Windows and I have a 64-bit Windows, so I should click on this in order to download the installation file. So you can see here is the file which we have downloaded. So right click on it and click on Run as Administrator. And remember that you should check this one at python.exe to path and click on this customize installation. Here you should press next. And here you should specify a path for the installation. So now suppose that I want to install my Python in this path. So first of all, I should copy this path. And here I should specify the path and I should press install. And I should wait for the installation process. And you can see it's creating some files and folders. And you can see one of those files is python.exe, which is the Python interpreter, which is a very important file. For example, if you want to install PyCharm and other IDEs, you need to know the location of this Python interpreter. I mean, this python.exe file. So that's it. You can see the setup was successful. So I press close. And now we want to install the TensorFlow. So first of all, in the Google search for TensorFlow PyPy, and you can see this is the website, pypy.org, and click on it. So as you can see, one of the methods in order to install TensorFlow is to simply use pip install TensorFlow, but I myself had problems using this command in order to install TensorFlow. So I want to use another method in order to install TensorFlow. So first of all, I should click on this, download files, and you can see that these files are for Python 3.10. You can see Python 3.10, Python 3.10, Python 3.10. But this one is for Python 3.9. So I have installed Python 3.10. So I should use one of these files. And you can see that this is for Windows. This is for Linux. And this is for Mac. So because I'm on Windows, I want to download this file. So that's it. You can see that we have downloaded this file, this TensorFlow wheel file. And now in order to install this file, first of all, you should copy this path. So I copy this path. And on your keyboard, you should press Windows and R key. And here you should simply type CMD. It stands for Command Window. And you should press OK. So now you can see a black window like this will be opened. So let's zoom in. And here you should simply type CD. It stands for change directory and you should press the space key on your keyboard in order to put a space and you should paste this path and you should press enter and after typing this and pressing enter once again because this path is in our h drive so here you should simply type h and colon and you should press enter so now you can see the path has changed and now i simply type pip space install space and I press tab on my keyboard. So you can see this is the first file in that directory. So once again, I press tab. And now you can see this is the file that we want to install, TensorFlow. And this is the wheel file. So I press enter. And I should wait for the installation process. So as you can see, because TensorFlow needs other packages as well, it is downloading those packages. So remember that it should have internet connection during the installation process because it is going to download other packages as well. And now after downloading these packages, now it's installing all of these packages. So that's it. You can see that the installation was successful. So let's close this. And now in the search of Windows, you should simply search for IDLE. Remember that it is IDLE, not IDE. It is IDLE. It has L. So click on it. And here you should simply type import TensorFlow as TF. And I press enter. And I should wait for importing this package. So you can see the importing process has been done. And now I simply type print tf dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore. 
And if I press enter, you can see here is the version of TensorFlow which we have installed. So as you can see, the TensorFlow has been successfully installed. And also remember that when you install the TensorFlow, the Keras is also installed. So here, if I import the Keras, and if I press enter, and once again, if I print Keras dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore, and if I press enter, you can see here is the version of Keras. So you can see the Keras has been also successfully installed. Now I really suggest you to watch this video which is on the screen now.